I have the Nintendo Switch and I'll be showing you how to get faster internet on this console. Now, before we can start any test or any of the methods I want to show you on how to increase your internet speed, let's first of all get a test of the current speed. So we can go into system settings. Under system settings, go to internet and then go to test connection. And let's have a look at the current internet speed. So we have 33.7 Mbps for download and 28 for upload. Okay, so let's concentrate on the, the download speed, which will be our guide. So 33.7 Mbps. So here are a couple of things you can do to make your internet connection faster. First is to restart your router. So in case you know your router is capable of much faster speeds than this, then you might want to go ahead and try and restart it and also test it with other devices to see if the internet speed is better on those other devices. Restarting your router usually helps with slow internet speed. Now, the other thing you can do is connect to a 5G network if it's available. Now, most modern routers uh, have two Wi-Fi networks, the main Wi-Fi and also a, four, a 5G version of that same Wi-Fi. Although the 5G version might be a bit, uh, doesn't have quite the same range, doesn't go through walls quite, uh, quite as well as the 4G network. But then if you're close by, you can try and change to the 5G network of your router if it has one, and that should uh, drastically improve your internet speed. Now, the other thing you can do to improve your internet speed is to just move closer to the router physically, okay? So if the router is in a certain room, then sitting in that room with your Nintendo Switch, after all, this is a portable device, you can just move it anywhere. Sitting in that room that has the router will give you significantly much better speeds than being one, two, three rooms away where you have all the interference from the walls that will affect your internet speed. So being in the same room or as close as possible to the router helps with your internet speed. Something else you can do in case you are maybe trying to play a game online versus someone in those uh, two player online games, then check if you have a, a, a game or a piece of software that is currently downloading. So if you have something downloading, then that might be affecting the latency and making your game slower and might be difficult to play an online game. So you might want to go ahead and cancel current downloads. So if you have a download that's happening, you can cancel that and maybe download it later when you're not playing a game. So canceling any downloads that are happening as you play will affect and will make your internet speed slow. Now, the other thing you can do is uh, connect an Ethernet cable. So if you have an Ethernet cable on your Nintendo Switch, you can connect. And this not only works for the dock, because the dock is uh, obvious, especially if you have this new uh, OLED Nintendo Switches, you can actually connect your Nintendo Switch to an Ethernet cable without necessarily using the dock. Okay, so to do that, you're going to have to get an adapter like this one an adapter that has an Ethernet port and a Type-C connector. So you can just connect your Type-C uh, adapter here and connect your Ethernet cable here and the other end of the Ethernet cable to your router. And that should give you significantly high speeds. So in fact, let's go ahead and connect that. So once you connect physically, you have to go ahead and connect using the interface. So go to system settings and then go to internet, select that and then Go to Internet Settings, select that. And then scroll down to Wired Connection and select that. And then confirm by selecting Connect to the Internet via Wired Connection. Select that as well. Now, once it's connected, you should have significantly higher Internet speeds. In fact, let's go ahead and test. So like I said, there are a couple of things you can do and it might be different and you might be having different problems for the, from the next person. But usually, as you can see, that has more than doubled our speed. Okay, we were at 33 Mbps. Now we are at almost 80. And that basically that little change 
has almost doubled the internet speed of our Nintendo console. So those are the things you can do. You don't have to do everything I've said. You can do one or the other depending on your current scenario and that should uh, definitely increase your internet speed. Thanks for watching and good luck.